help just me, <laughs> said hen. No, I can't, said dog. Can you see? On the basis of initiating a program, as we saw today, where children can read to dogs. And the beauty of the program is that dogs are obviously non-judgmental and the kids bond with the dogs really well. So it's a real win-win situation. The dogs enjoy the, uh, the attention they're getting and the kids obviously enjoy reading to the dogs. Let's hear the title. Okay, can you now have some help if I mess it up? Sure. The things. Things. Fly. That fly. That fly. Well, I think what happens if a child is not reading particularly well or not enjoying reading, parents can often apply a little bit of negative pressure on them. You know, they feel like they should be doing better and this kind of thing. By reading to a dog, being non-judgmental, they can relax a lot more and they can just practice their reading without any form of negative interference. And that's the real key to the program. Well, I'm a, I'm a dog nut. I mean, I'm, I'm a certified dog trainer. I also love reading, so for me it was a, it was a natural fit to bring a dog with a book. It's, <laughs> it's just the way it was going to go. And I know uh, just how they can affect people's lives in a very positive way. Uh, so between the experience with the service dogs and then developing the therapy dogs, it, they, the dogs can offer so much to us as far as helping us in life. And this is just one example of many.